everyone and welcome back to another Train Tim Classic video. We have got a good one today. Ignore that train over to the right there, that is horrible. Uh, my driver, this is the 0811 service to Milton Keynes Central. Allow passengers to board while you prefer your cab. This is a DOO service as far as Clapham Junction. So I think then we get a guard on board. Uh, eight coaches. Uh, let's do that. Uh, let's do that. Neutral. AWS. Uh, that's all set. So yeah, we're eight coaches. Uh, we've got 211 on the front and on the back we have got 215. Uh, yes, uh, driver ID 8754, whatever. Um, I'll get that changed to a Milton Keynes. And this is hopefully going to be the full service, um, as this is the route merge, which adds in uh, the West London line, which I didn't wasn't aware of, but well, we've got it, so. Um, I'll leave a link below. So yeah, we're going to be running up to uh, up to Milton Keynes on this part. On this episode, we'll go as far as Wilson Junction here. Oh yeah, well, just after Shepherd's Bush. That's how far we'll be going on this bit. It's 8.53 and the time at the moment is 8.11. Doors open. That'll be a good start. So yeah. Got about 40 minutes on this bit up to uh, Shepherd's Bush. Uh, GSMR 2 Mike 19, 2 Mike 1 9, standing at signal 108. Tango 108. Sadly, this service doesn't exist anymore. They only go as far as Hemel Hempstead now. Well, Watford Junction for the most part. One of those annoying service cuts. Off, the door shut. Get that off. Interlock, let's go. So, your next station will be Selhurst. Get rid of that keyboard with my console unplugged in still. We're off. But yeah, once we get to Clapham Junction, we'll go to um, Guard, as I believe the West London line, you still have guards on it. Which is good, we like guards. There we go. Yeah, very useful service this was, up to Milton Keynes. It's basically, if you wanted to get up to, you know, Birmingham, Manchester, Liverpool, you didn't have to go right into London. You just went sort of round. A bit like Thameslink, but... Southern. I suppose Thameslink's good for the Midland Main Line and East Coast East Coast Main Line, primarily. But this is good for the West Coast Main Line. Yeah, sadly, it only goes up to... Well, Hemel Hempstead, but most, most of the time Watford Junction. Which I suppose is still good, but Milton Keynes is still much further up. Still a lot better. But as I suppose someone just don't have enough trains, don't have enough trains to run it. Um, that's why I got cut back. Well, I think the excuse was that you can still basically get on the same train at Watford Junction. I bloody love Southern, but it is a bit annoying. Some of these service cuts, like the Guildford service, Milton Keynes. It's like, why? Right, as we come up to Selhurst. Selhurst, however you want to say it. Cool. Look at that, what a lovely train in there. No more though, gone. What an outstanding train. This is ours, we are eight coaches. Let's look for the eight coach dot marker. On the 
Oh, I suppose this is this is the old BML route. This is the old London to Brighton route. If we start off on, see, I never driven the West London line, so we might put. Well, I don't know. We we could keep the HUD off. Nah, we'll probably put it on. We won't know it past Clapham Junction up to uh, Shepherd's Bush. It's probably about what 30, 40 miles an hour the whole way though. Can't imagine it's quick. Five. I guess that must be going down to uh, Epsom Downs. Or just Sutton. So here we are at Selhurst as we await time. We actually are a little bit late actually. So we weren't sort of fast where we out of um, East Croydon. No, we've got three minutes, so that's fine. Yeah, we do have a bit of a dwell time here. We get the door shut about now. Uh, Fords and Heath next. I think we're all stations to clap them. Maybe even one's worth common. Let's go. So this bit you can actually do on TSW. A little bit slightly unrealistically. As it's a DC powered 377. Off we go. Getting that up. There's number 377. <laughs> I'm looking forward to just getting on to the bit past Clapham. That's the bit I'm waiting for. If you want to feel free to skip just a bit after Clapham. That is like the main bit. Uh, which I'm interested in seeing. Sort of the whole point of doing this scenario. It's being able to see the West London line. Which here is uh, Imperial Wharf, West Brompton. Kensington Olympia, Shepherd's Bush, and then well, up past Wollstone Junction. Although we don't stop at Wollstone Junction. And over 455. Always lovely to see in the game. It's sad that they've gone in real life from Southern. Still run for Southwest for now. We are at Thornton Heath. And we're going right down to the uh, DOO monitors, which don't we don't really need as we've got the um, train cameras. Here we are. This is Thornton Heath. Do we stop at Wandsworth Common? So Common, Ballon. No, we don't. That's the only one we miss out. Is uh, Wandsworth Common. Good. One less stop. And we're out of here at. You've got a bit of dwell time, don't you, at some of these stations? So we'll be in and out as quick as we can. comes the fast service. Can we be on that fast service to Clapham? Take it over from there. Probably a dash one that one. Also looking forward to running this on the West Coast Main Line as I don't think we've done that before. So that'll be uh, new. Right, Norbury next. We're interlock. Let's go. That was trying on the way down. It's a little bit laggy on this bit, but as I said, it's sort of the busy part of the main line. It's always laggy this bit. Up to, was it 70? Was it? I think it was 70. 
those lines. About 70 on the on the fast lines. Don't really do the slow very much. Norbridge just up round the corner. Another service there. Yeah, Norbridge just round there. So not too far along. Fingers well it doesn't crash as well. It's by Clapham, it's gonna be busy, but after that it should sort of be alright, I hope. Right now approaching at Norbury. Start bringing that speed down. As we cruise through South London. And we've got the nice passenger view as well, which looks really, really good. Passenger view on this is probably better than the TSW passenger view. Especially the light and the light in spot on. I was like Shepherd's Bush we also changed from DC to AC power. A little bit quicker. Here we are, this is Norbury. And we're we'll out of here at 22, so we've still got well, actually not too long. 30 seconds, and we'll get the door shut. And then um, stretch them kind of 60, yeah, 60 on the, uh, on the up slow. Central. Be a yeah, prime rush hour. This is 8:21 in the morning. So we'll be basically seeing every single train. Have some downs there. Oh, it's about nine coach that one. Oh no, ten coach. Two threes and then um, a four. One of the cool consists to say. Seen that one before actually. Valley line. Let's go. Onwards to Stretton Common. Yeah, I'm seeing how, how fast the West, Lon the West London line's going to be. I'd imagine probably quite slow. It's not going to be quick, is it? Probably, what, 30, 40 miles an hour? Well, maybe we'll be surprised. Maybe it will be. Well, I, I am tempted to do it hard, even though we don't know it. I still want to do it hardless. I might, I might just do it hardless. I mean, what's the worst what could happen? I mean, it's probably going to be fairly slow anyway, so might as well just do the whole part one hardless, and then part two we'll get the hard on. So that's where we we just don't know at all. Probably do it as far as Watford Junction, Hudless, but after that we'd have to whack it on. Right, this is uh, Streatham Common. That'll be right towards the end. Yeah, right to the end of the platform here at Streatham Common. That's all colliding. Uh, and this route is well. It's the Brighton Main Line, but this is part of the route merge. It's like the Brighton. No, it's like the West Coast Main Line, South Goblin, North London Line, South London Brighton Main Line merge. Tons of routes put into one. I'll show you on on here on the map. <clears throat> so this is all the South London bit. It was what's that? Is that the oh, down to, so a bit of the Chatham Main Line in there then? Yeah, it's quite a... And there's the West London line here going up. 
So it's quite a bundle of uh, roots it adds. Right, 30 seconds. Here at Streatham Common. So I get the West London line, we're getting closer. service there. Right, let's get the door shut. And it will be Ballam next. Two more stations. Ballam, Clapham, and then we're on to uh, on to the line we want to see. I want to see how well it's been done. Hopefully there actually is scenery. Start getting that up again. Yeah, we're getting that, we're getting close. How long does it mean it's clapping? Only 15 minutes. It feels like it's been longer. It always feels longer no, since he's corroded. Four, five, five. Lovely again to see. Up to sixty. It's down to forty round the corner into Ballon. Is it too far? Too much further up. Get a bit of speed on us again. Get passenger view as well. Three seven seven have a really nice interior, very sort of calm and relaxing interior. I mean, the three plus two is a bit in, but two plus two seat and it's um, that lovely. Right, so we're coming around the corner now, and then that will then bring us into Ballon. And we we'll have the line from Streatham Hildred near us. Warning for the 40. And there's the other line joining up. And then round the corner, and in we go. It's 40. So I get cautionary signals as well now. Makes it a bit more exciting. Following something, probably something well from Streatham Hill, from that way, or oh, something from down from the Mole Valley. There we are. Right to the end of the platform again. Careful these ones. That would do, I reckon. Here we are, this is uh, Ballon. Look at that spot on the marker. Perfect. Uh, press T as well, that would help. So we're due out of here at 29, so basically as soon as everybody's on, we are off. That's a lovely 455. So we're not stopping at 1, so I've come in. Right. And we're off. Ho 
Hopefully it's not too not hopefully you can hear me alright. I did put the audio down just a, just a tad, just in case. Hopefully it's relatively okay. And let's go. It's nice and quick through Wandsworth Common, which is just round the corner. And yeah, we're almost at the West London line. And then once we get to Clapham, we'll change it to Guard Operated, which it realistically would be, I think, the rest of the way well, too. Milton Keynes. You've got Wandsworth Common, bit of flange round through here. Feels a bit quicker than at 60 through here, but it is, it is 60, but it feels quick. Feels a lot less, well, feels a much smoother around there on TSW. I don't know if that's because you bank round or. I really feel it on this one. Pressing AWS, pressing AWS. Train Sim Blimming Classic. And that does it. So we're going to a stop. Sometimes when it lags this game, you click you click the button, it just it's like nope, don't want anything to do with it. <sighs> Sorry, passengers, fault with the train. <laughs> Always annoying when that happens. There's actually nothing you can do. Well, apart from clicking the button like that, but even that, if it's lagging, it might not um, accept it. Oh well. That's single yellow. Probably waiting for a train to come out of uh, Clapham. The Clapham platform 15, I think. And then we're going to platform 16. And curls off down the West London line. I think I don't know what I'll call this video. I probably will just call it West London line part. I don't know one or two or whatever. So we will do part two after, which then takes us up to Milton Keynes. I've got a case. Come on. No, don't muck around. Come on, we're driving a train. Here. If you're gonna get on the seat, go on the seat. Like, I don't know, maybe. You got the Southwest Mail, I don't know if there are Southwest AI. To a nice gentle stop. Get that on. Probably I'll just see I went for a train coming out of the um, platform. I don't know what time we were due. There's a 378 over there. I don't know what time we were due. Due in there. Uh, we'll tab it. We'll have a look. Yeah. Oh, here comes something now, actually. Something's on the way out. Might be what it is. Fingers crossed. Uh, yeah, probably is what we're waiting for, coming out of platform 15, which then sort of blocks our route across. That is most likely what it is. Uh, yeah, two India service there, or one India, I think, as they used to be now. Approaching Clapham Junction. Right, the guard will get on board and take us onwards. And it 
it's quite a tight corner into uh, platform 15 as well. Platform 16, I mean, platform 16. Okay. Another service from uh, Milton Keynes there. As on this platform, you can't then get back to the main line, so this literally just is West London line services. There's the cat ace, all hyperactive at the moment. Oh my god, what are you doing? Oh, come on. Oh. I bet she's had some catnip or something, she's all hyperactive, jumping all over the place. that over there? Is that oh, it's South West 455. Well, there's the South West AI, which just makes it really laggy and lovely. Go away South West, you're making it laggy. is Clapham Junction, so let's get the guard on board, which actually I think we have to do here once the doors are shut. Press T. We'll do it over at 40. Why have we got so long here? Okay, we've got a bit of time here. We've got four minutes. Well, I shall see you all once those four minutes are up. Right, we are good to go. And there we are begin our West London line adventure. So let's go. Starting speed limit is 10 miles per hour and it goes up to 30. We're just going to do it hardless. We're just going to wing it. Um, I mean you can't really go wrong on two tracks. 30 miles an hour. So I'm stopping at every stop anyway. So any stop we say we slow down for. Oh that lag. Oh. Went to about 12 miles an hour there. I can't put the bloody power brake thing down. Right, we're back to past that 30, and then we'll go up to 30. And get out of the really, really busy Clapham Junction. Out we go. Try and escape here fairly quickly. So we've got Imperial Wharf, West Brompton, uh, Kensington and Olympia, and then Shepherd's Bush. Again, I don't know how it's going to look. Hopefully it'll look decent. Fingers crossed. So we go under the Brighton main line. It's exciting though, it's exciting to see us going this way. It's just like new this is. Shall we been that we might have been down this bit actually, just like once and it ended. But not you know past. Past here. Well, here it goes. So under the Brighton main line and the southwest main line. As we enter, well, we have like we are on the West London line now. This is it. Is that an old route master? <laughs> yes, there we are. I'm already brought down by something. Oh, the scenery, so that's a good start. Double yellow. So we will go over the Thames as well. Slightly further up. Still 30? Yeah, still 30. Probably will be the speed limit for most of it. Maybe 40 or so at most. Sort of a very inner city route. Now, Imperial Wharf is actually a fairly new station. It opened, I think, in 2009 ish. Um, correct me if I'm wrong. 
And it's just as you get over there. It's basically just past the river bridge. Away from, uh, away from the main line. This is exciting stuff. Oh, is this the river already here? Well, we're now approaching Imperial Wharf quite soon then. Thought we'd be a bit further around, but maybe not. There's, well, it's just around there, wasn't it? Well, we're going over the Thames. Cool. Let's get a, uh, a screenshot as we come across here. Uh, a bit further down, maybe. Don't pause breaks, so we don't need to worry about time. There we are. 50, okay. So we're going a little bit quicker then. Well, we've got to slow down anyway for Imperial Wharf. We should look fairly modern. Well, at least out of the assets there is, yeah, it's not too bad. So we're eight coaches. So right to the end. Should all be able to fit in. This is good. I mean, it's great to be on a new line we haven't done before. Another southern route as well. Slash overground. Oh, we all fit on. Welcome to Imperial Wharf. Now, if this is West Brompton or West Brom, Brompton, or Bromwich. Out of here pretty soon. Have the guard to do all the doors. A bit noisy. Get that up. I'm pretty certain we are guard operated, so there we are. Let's get so up to 50 miles per hour. exciting part of this video, this part of the route. Up to uh, 50. Can't imagine it's too far to West Brom. West Brompton. There's just sort of a sneaky cut through London. Not completely through, I mean, fairly central. Now this line used to be a lot more uh, like an officer, a lot more important than it is today. But well, it's still very important, it's still a very important route, but it used to get you know, lots of long distance trains coming along here. I think was it even the Eurostar used to come along here to get to um, uh, the North Pole Depot. They used to get used I suppose a lot more this will be West Brompton coming up. And that, tube trains. Yeah, cool. So you've got the um, district line. What a treat, and a 378 as well. Yeah, treating all the trains we see. Well, this is West, uh, okay, West, uh, West Brompton. Okay, the 
tube trains and uh, wherever they're going. Where they're going. Then. It would actually be quite nice to get a shot with the um, 378 we see another one. Kensington Olympia next. Let's go. They're probably not too far along. And that's where the district line terminates, or one of the bits. Terminate. So we're almost at the West Coast Main Line, which doesn't take us fly us up to Milton Keynes. Probably the sort of another 45 minutes for that bit. But yeah, a lot of trains some classic videos recently, so hopefully everyone's all right with that. It's just been not really much else going on, and I've just sort of been in the TSC mood. We've had all different bits and bobs coming out for it, so why not? Junction indicator, I can see up here. Yes. I built up place we're coming up to. Thirty miles. Uh, no, hang on. a bit further up here. Yeah, 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 we'll be coming, yeah. This is a really well done route. Really well done. I think this again, this is Dovetail Games Danny. That's what I mean, it's free time he does these, um, these famous. Well, Kensington Olympia, which yeah, used to be a really sort of uh, quite you know lots of important trains came here. Obviously nowadays not as much, <coughs> but the car park sort of within the uh, some sort of warehouse there, uh, station shed, or X station shed. Yeah, this is Kensington Olympia. And one of those shots there. And then it will be Shepherd's Bush next. Um, and then, yeah, we'll go to the signal a bit further up. In fact, we actually go all the way over there. Continue. I wonder if we see any more overground trains. I want to get a screenshot of one of them. Leaving Kensington Olympia. I was actually going to go on this line fairly recently. I had a little trip planned up to uh, Watford Junction. Once I got to East Croydon, which cancelled. So I never did it in the end. I think, where did I go in the end on there? Where did I go instead? I think I went up to Victoria, had a little look around there and just went all the way down to sort of on the East Coast way. So I still need to do, still need to head up this way again. I've been on this line once before, but that would have been 2014, 2015. And that was um, as far as Watford Junction. Um, as I think it was like a Sunday, so they were only running up to Watford Junction, or up to Milton Keynes. And here's Shepherd's. But is this where we changed to overhead wires? I can't see any yet. So 
if we go a bit further up, I thought it was here we changed to um, the electrical wires, but well, <laughs> I can't see any inside, so maybe it is uh, a bit further up. I thought it was here though, we change over, unless maybe they're just not on here. Nowhere inside. <coughs> I suppose we do it somewhere else then. I did think it was here. But maybe not. That's what we want to screenshot with. Oh, we got to be quick here. So we'll try and get a screenshot of that. Of that there. There we go, that's what I want. Get another one as well, wait for that to go back through. There. I guess then that's where we change then. I thought I did it in the station here, but yeah, maybe we go up and then stop there and then change over. Oh, that's cool. Uh, uh, as soon as you complete change over, you may continue. Okay, so we do it outside of the station. That signal. Uh, Victor Charlie 813. Right, let's go. Looking out for Victor Charlie one uh, one eight three. Wait one three. Is it eight one three? Yeah. Victor Charlie eight one three. So I think that's the west. No, that's, you've got some sort of shopping centre there. Here at Shepherd's Bush. So I think I see wires. Can I see wires? No, not just yet. That won't be unless they're just missing. Yeah, they, they could be missing. Then. No, okay, that's not. So it'll be eight one, eight eleven, and eight thirteen. So another couple of signals along. How do these wires begin? I generally thought it was that Shepherd's Bush, but. Oh, we're still going, and we haven't found wires yet. The hunt for the wires. Once that third row ends, we're screwed. I think that's slightly slow. Here we go, hang on, here it was. Well, the next signal would be 811, though, wouldn't it? Because the last one was Victor Charlie 809. Could be 813. For all we know, there is like a little symbol saying power change, so I guess it's here. Okay, well, we'll do it here. And this is 813. What about 811 then? So just before the signal, it's quite cool. I'm not sure what the whole train is within. We'll just stick that on. Uh, step three. Right. Uh, I haven't done this in a little while. I think it's fairly straightforward. That made a nice noise. That sounds positive. Uh, have we got a thingy on here? Check the stairs. Well, we got none at the moment, so that's not, you know, great. That's warming up still. I can hear it doing things. We're powering up. So we're now we're now on the overhead wires. You can hear. And you should be able to see the panto graph's gone up. Yeah, panto's gone up. Maybe this menu doesn't work. Okay, so we should now be able to go. There we are. 
Oh, there we go, then that's coming up. Uh, so where does it want us to stop? Wilston Relief down. Okay, it's probably when we get a red light. Yeah, so we're now on overhead wires. It's quite easier to change over on the Electro Star. Is that 20 coming up? Oh, no, 30. Oh, that's sick. That's it. 60 straight to 30. I'd imagine that 15 is probably where we're going. So we've got to get down onto the West Coast mainland before this joins up with the uh, North London line. So otherwise we're going to go into Wilston Junction overhead, which we don't want to be doing. So we might be coming down here. Might might be. Probably would have a junction indicator, but... Okay, not down there. Oh, well, <laughs> we'll go for it. No, we, I don't know. We're going up this way, okay. Why does it want us to stop? I still in my okay, it's still a bit of a way away. I thought it was literally right here. But no. Now here we go, yeah, that looks uh, that looks a bit better. In fact that that's the Great Western mainland, so we don't want to be going down there. Yeah, I think that's the uh, Great Western down there, so yeah, we we wouldn't want to be going down there. Why are we not breaking? What's going on? Wasn't the, we had a what was it a position two junction indicator? So I thought we were going to come across a bit sooner, but maybe not. This is like uh, where we going? Where we going? Well, that's the no, that's the high level, isn't it? That must be up there. Now. Is that the high level, Austin Junction? How does the overground get up there then? Where, where, I need to check where we are. Oh, we're there. Oh, okay, that comes off there. Ah, okay. So we're now down below. Yeah, well, the Bakerloo line over there. Always wondered how this gets down onto here. It's quite cool to, uh, to see. takes us on yeah, we're going quite a way up actually we're going all the way up to there I think are we where does it want us to stop okay still up there we're still going the right way it's been a really cool little journey so I'm just exploring how yeah I, I didn't I, no idea how this was done, how this got down to here, but now we know. Yeah, 377 on the West Coast Main Line. Have some of that, you 350s and 390s. We're here, 730s as well. Yeah, so that's the Bakerloo there. On the right and left of the, the Main Line there, West Coast Main Line. So it wants us to stop. This must be quite soon. I suppose, yeah, part two will probably start from here, won't it? I was like, where is the objective? It's not. Up here, no. Is it there? 
Oh, it's, it's just here. Where do you want us? Oh, it is here. Okay. Okay, insect. Well, there we go. Uh, I shall see you in the second part where we then take this the rest of the way up to Milton Keynes. Hopefully, everyone has enjoyed it. Links can be found in the usual places Discord, PayPal, merch store. Apart from that, thanks all for coming in, and I hope to see you in part two. See you all. Take care. Bye, guys. Thank you.